Zoom session. Uh, welcome to the post-game press conference of the BCA game uh, Telecom Baskets Bonn versus Batshuayi Kolegi. The final score is 74 to 68. For the first part of this press conference, we have with us Erin Ernak, head coach of Batshuayi Kolegi, and player Jakub Blažić. Uh, as always, we start with the player uh, Jakub Blažić. Your statement about the game, please. Um, congrats to Bonn for this win. Uh, they are playing very good basketball all season. Uh, they showed that today also. Um, they start very strong uh, and make difference. Uh, and they played solid game until the end. But uh, it's good for us that we didn't surrender, that we hustle, and uh, we got the difference, which is which is acceptable. And uh, we have to work uh, forward and just try to win uh, next game next week. Uh, you managed to make it a, like a tight game in, a, in the fourth quarter. How did you manage this? Uh, we just fight it more on defense. We, I think, we were more focused on uh, on, on details, and um, maybe that's the key. Also, something I think we learned because uh, we are still kind of kind of new with all the problems we had at the beginning of the season. We our uh, point guard got injured uh, on the last uh, uh, game, and uh, I think we are improving, and that we have a chance to to go to to next round. Thank you very much. Gibt es Fragen? Are there any questions? No questions, then thank you. Okay. Can we if you want to? Thank you. And we'll continue right away with head coach Ehan Ernak. Coach, your statement, please. Yes, when we come here, we expect a very difficult game uh, because uh, Bonn is, I think, better shape uh, than us. Uh, we had a lot of problem day by day. We saw, but we are not ready for me. Uh, especially in away games, we have to uh, play more with discipline. Uh, beginning of the game, we didn't execute. Uh, second part of the game, uh, third and fourth quarter, defensively, uh, we execute our defensive plan. But uh, for sure, we, we might make score. Uh, we didn't create today. Uh, it was another problem for my team. Uh, yes, we have five more games. Uh, we will work, we will try to get lessons from our mistakes uh, and we will try to uh, win our next games and uh, we will try to continue for second round, third round. Thank you very much. Are there any questions? No questions? Then thank you very much, Coach. Thank you. Safe travels. Thank you. And in a few moments, we'll continue with uh, Telekom Basket Spawn head coach Thomas Isalo and player Sebastian Ereja.
And we're back with the second part of the press conference now with head coach of Telecom Baskets Bonn, Thomas Iselo, and player Seba Herrera. We'll start with player, with the player Seba Herrera. Your statement about the game, please. Uh, well, um, it was a, it was a, so it was a game that um, was a different, two different teams that tried to set their, their identity. Um, we only could manage for a couple of minutes um, to set to set the tone or what we work for. Um, we had uh, uh, many mistakes that we we are trying to avoid, um, but uh, somehow we managed to 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 get the win. But uh, still, a lot to to improve. Uh, Bashashio made it a, a tight game in the fourth. How did they manage to to come back in the fourth and and yeah manage to make it a tight game? Um, out of our mistakes, mm. mostly. Okay. Thank you very much. Gibt es Fragen? Are there any questions for Seba Herrera? No questions? Then thank you, Seba. Thank you. And we we'll continue right away with Telekom Basketball head coach, Thomas Isolo. Thomas, your statement, please. Well, the most important thing is we got the win against an experienced team that uh, again showed ability to climb out of a difficult situation in the, in the fourth quarter. Um, on the other side, I fully agree with Seba. This was not an acceptable performance from us uh, in many ways. Uh, we did not put our stamp on the game. We did not we did not plan to cut down on the lead, which is very important also in this competition with, with very, very few games in each group stage and then and then the other stuff I won't I won't comment, but was a lot, a lot of very disappointing things in this game. Uh, not just not just from our performance side but but also some things that I have never seen in in, in my life in a, in a basketball game. Thank you very much. Are there any questions? No questions? Then thank you, coach. And with this, we will end the post-game press conference for tonight's game. Thank you very much. Thank you.